the Jackbox Party Pack 4, a pretty okay collection. Party Pack 4 is probably one of the weaker collections. Like all party packs, the more players the better, as with 3 players or less, you rarely get much enjoyment out of these games. Party Pack 4 consists of 5 games that you play using your phone rather than a controller. First we have Fibbage 3, which is a great update, but Fibbage is kind of losing its spark. This is a game where you try to come up with the best lie to make everyone choose it, and a random trivia game for points. Though to improve and not just make it another Fibbage game, there's a bonus enough about you option where the questions are about the players in the room, making it much more fun, full of laughs and not as stale as Fibbage otherwise would be at this point. Next is Survive the Internet. You try to come up with the most ridiculous comments and captions for posts and photos on the internet. With the right people, this has the potential to be pretty funny one or two times, but loses its flair pretty quickly. Next is the best addition to the Party Pack universe, Monster Seeking Monster. You are all secret monsters, trying to get dates and use your secret ability to get the most hearts out of all other players who have their own secret agenda and strategy to win. This can be really fun and full of strategy, trying to date around other players' abilities. But I feel it's too short of a game to bring out this game's full potential. Things don't get juicy until it's almost over. Definitely feels half-baked. Then there's racketeering, the weakest of the games. You vote on random brackets you all come up with. Not much else to say, that's the game, it's pretty lame. And finally is Civic Doodle. It's always great when Jackbox lets you draw and be creative. And Civic Doodle is a game where two players keep adding onto a picture while other players vote on the drawing they would like to add to. And you keep drawing and drawing until you get to the final picture. This one's okay if you can get people to play it right. Otherwise it could easily turn into a pity party or a popularity contest. Jackbox Party Pack 4 shows up with some games with some promise, but ultimately doesn't do enough to be a must have in your collection. But I would love to see a revamp of Monster Seeking Monster in the future, as this is probably the closest thing to a reason to have Party Pack 4. I give the Jackbox Party Pack 4 a 6.5 out of 10. If you played the Jackbox Party Pack 4, tell me what you thought about it down in the comment section below. If you haven't played it, tell me if you plan on picking it up. Thumbs up. If you like the video, subscribe for new to the channel. Follow me on Instagram at Gaming. Thanks for watching, and of course, stay beautiful. Serial Killer! The serial killer steals two hearts from a player the second time they date each other. From my experience, it's safe to date a serial killer at least once. You thought that video was good? Ha! Huh. You should probably watch this video. The very video that's on your screen right now that YouTube hand-selected for you out of all my thousands of videos. This is the one that it wants you to watch next. And make sure you're subscribed because I'm not a genie or anything, but I'm pretty sure you get 42 years of bad luck if you made it this far into my video and you're not subscribed. You don't have to subscribe, but I'm just looking out for you. I'm just looking out for your luck and your life.